Hey Gemini Sun with Taurus Rising. How y'all doing? It's your girl Ruth. Welcome back to another little series. And I thought I'd do it on Taurus Rising people. So now I am going to read a little bit about y'all and then we'll do a tarot, okay? Alright, let's get started. It says your stable communicators, the Venus and Mercury. Uh, dance together well, mixing everything that is poetic, swift, communicative uh, about Gemini into one ball of sensual, down-to-earth, practical energy that is extremely self-sufficient and solid, mixture of masculine and feminine, toned down the extroverted nature of Gemini and bringing out the introverted nature of Taurus more into the public eye. In Greek mythology, now this is kind of, I was gonna read it. <laughs> Venus, Aphrodite, Mercury, Hermes. Aphrodite is his aunt, okay, his great aunt. But Hermes seduced her, okay? <clears throat> With the help of Zeus, of course, Jupiter. And they had a child named Herma Phyroditis. H E put Hermia and Aphrodite together, the last part of Aphrodite. Crazy with this crazy with this with two wait a minute, what I got. Taurus placements, you are more grounded. Oh I said crazy. What just happened? Okay, you seduce your aunt. Ew. Okay. With two Taurus placements, you are more grounded with this Taurus placement, sorry, and more and be and more practical. Uh, stomach area, like to eat a lot, of course. You may work in technology, graphic design, or help people do or make makeovers, you know, in all kind of ways, even in homes, decorating, property, whatever. Real estate agent, your goals, uh, you may be a lawyer. Matt could be a marriage counselor, writer of romance novels, literature, singers, the list goes on. But those kind of fit you. Uh, there, most, there must be a balance of work and social life. So don't work workaholic because you know both of y'all signs can get to working. Important not to drink alcohol too much or too many toxins in your body. Herbal teas, flush it out with water. Uh, you will love to overindulge and with good food and, you know, the pleasures of life, but it will hurt you in some type of way. You're attracted to dark mysteries, mysterious types of people, bad boys, bad girls. You like the mystery of it. Uh, you will roam around a lot. You like the energies of the dark mysteries of people. Um... What I got? Yeah, you like you like the imagination of it. That's why whoever with you needs to really stimulate your imagination part. When you find out the mystery of it, you're not interested anymore. You get bored. That's when that Gemini comes out. I think it's more like a Scorpio Gemini to me because you like the mystery. You like to uncover the person layer by layer, you know? But if they just let it all out, you don't really like that. Okay, anyway. <laughs> So let's do a health and see what whoever you believe in wants to say. Give you the heads up besides what we already talked about. Let's see, we're gonna do Jimmy Jam first. It could be a mixture. Okay, we got oh boy, that's too many. Let's do it again. And we got uh lower back, watch something fun with your kids, family, friend. Go to the park, etc. Somewhere fun, okay. And then we have shoulder exercise videos and lotion. Keep your skin lotioned up. All that great stuff. Now we're going to the Taurus pile. See what they want to tell on your Taurus side. Y'all very mysterious yourself. Interesting too. Mouth exercise, okay. And let's see what else. Your path, what's your destiny, reason for being here. And y'all like a Capricorn too. 
I had the pleasure of one of y'all before. <laughs> it was definitely mysterious. Anyway, okay. <clears throat> let's see, let's do a little tarot and see what's up. Uh, thrill swords reverse second deacon libra moon deception frustration jealousy broken heart so your heart's not broken anymore maybe just broke up with someone okay then we have uh nine of pentacles reverse second deacon virgo mercury venus that's mercury and gemini and venus uh taurus Peace of mind, contentment. So you kind of broken hearted about that. Well, you don't. You're not broken hearted, but you don't have peace of mind about it. Maybe the person is feeling to some type of way. Cause you know y'all like y'all little pleasures. I'm just saying. <laughs> I don't mean no harm. Sorry. King of Cups, Libra, Scorpio, man over 25 years, blue eyes, fair to brown hair, gentle, emotional, and shy. Y'all kind of mysterious and quiet. This could be y'all. Kind of like, okay. Yeah. Sitting on the throne. Yeah, that's that's definitely y'all. Okay, we got judgment. So you're doubting. Maybe you make the right decision and breaking up. You know, maybe you should open up more, stuff like that. Uh, decisions, finality, the only decision that can be made under the circumstances, and you're doubting the decision that you made. Maybe you did open up. Okay. Uh, the high priestess, moon, water, highest card in the tarot deck, very powerful, good or bad, secrets to be revealed. It's reversed. Yeah, you didn't open up. You didn't tell a secret, your secrets, and that caused the breakup, maybe. Yeah, we got the two of cups. So yeah, peace of mind, joining the two people, second deacon, cancer, Venus. Yes, yeah, always good to be honest. Okay. Some people can take it and some people can't. You know, that's why I don't like the way the church and people, that the church separate the type of people, especially in women. Men too, but mostly women. You know, you need a church woman who's this, who's that, and then it's separating each woman, you know, for different categories. Everybody can change, and it's all according to what you like. You know what I'm saying? So it shouldn't matter what anybody else is talking about. The type of person that you want in your life, man or woman. This could be a man or woman, whoever. Okay, we got uh, four of wands, happy home, possible country setting, third deacon, Aries, Venus, and that's reverse. So, yeah, this looks like a breakup to me. You're scared to tell her your secrets. Five of Pentacles, first deacon, Taurus, Mercury, that's you. Delays around money coming in from the cold. So, yeah. Either somebody put you out or, or you left or, or they left or whatever it is. Hangman, getting stronger in oneself after a lot of deliberating and delaying in your life. Neptune water, so it's reverse kind of in your feelings about it or that person. Maybe both of y'all. Harsh. You know, I always hate breakups. But the magician is here, dun, 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 dun. Mercury, air, warlock, map, science, alchemist, element of surprise, good or bad, know how elements work, so you can fix it, just got to be open and honest and not play no games, you know, my suggestion, don't have to listen to me.
whether the person take you back or not. But I think it's some things you need to work on yourself. You know what I'm saying? Before you let, and be truthful to yourself. Before you uh, let anybody else back in. Yeah. Are you an open book or a closed book? You tell the truth or you won't. You know what I'm saying? Somebody wanted kids or didn't want kids? Which one was it? Or somebody too childish or not childish enough? Or somebody lost the baby. My condolences, if y'all did. So luck is on your side. Go put that over here with the magician. Was that the reason for the breakup? Maybe a baby was involved that wasn't y'all, you know, y'all didn't have together and found out or something. You cut it loose, whatever it is, habits, addictions, other people. Or that person cut you loose, or you cut them loose, whatever the deal is. Like I said, everybody's a star now, right? Okay. Still shining. It's not the end of the world. You know. Keep it moving if you want. Let me see what else that star means. Shining future. Which is coming true. A stroke of luck. Very positive. So, the person still love you. You know. Y'all still love each other. Maybe y'all need to really get to know each other now. Maybe that person was playing a role too. Maybe I could be yourself now. You know, you never know. Try it in the sea. Let's see what the Egyptian cards got to say. Got the Ten of Swords reversed. So nobody's bickering and arguing. We got the first scepter. That's double Aries. Okay. Somebody didn't hit somebody with a stick, huh? Hold on, let's see. Okay. Let's see. That is news of a business opportunity. Maybe I could work together. Or maybe it's a business you lost. Maybe that's what this about as well. Loss of business. You were trying to be a star or maybe a position or something like that. Let me see, we got the Jack of Cups. Let's see what that is. Pisces, negative, timid, listless, harmless, and much influenced by those about him. Right way up the nose of Pisces, man, I believe. So you're influenced by a lot of things. That's why I say y'all kind of remind me of a Capricorn. Um, but you believe everything is going to work out right. You got the magician, you got the uh, clover, okay. So, keep believing, you know, got your, wear your heart on your sleeve, everything will turn out right, whatever going on, okay, let's see, keep your vibrations high, okay, Cage inside him or herself. Can't speak control through fear. Hmm. Maybe that's where that shy card came from. They were showing. Booty call. Late at night. Yeah. Be careful with that. Okay, y'all kind of like the mystery of stuff. Argentina. Your name, Tina. Change their face. Wearing a wig. Mm. 
child marriage Bible and in some parts of the world. Okay. Car ride. Yeah. Okay. Let's see. Yes, I take action. Now I'm gone. Bad dreams. Fear, stuck, entangled, freedom, cage, rescue, protection, mantra. So you're fearing some stuff. Child abuse. Goes back to when you were young. It's probably where that child thing was reversed. Or did that happen? Are you sleeping well? If not, why? Is that what you found out where the breakup came from? Do you eat or order out a lot? Is it healthy? So you watch your diet, watch indulgence, giving us back our family inheritance legacy that they stole. Got to do with money. Let's see. I am not a nervous type person. That Gemini there, trying to. Calm down. I don't need drugs to survive. People always change when they're around me, good or bad, without taking my energy. I spend my money wisely so I won't be broke. Can't pay my bills. I help out. I am not a chameleon. I don't need to smoke to survive. I don't get bored or restless. I can calm down and be in the moment. That's why I say some things you got to work on yourself. You know what I'm saying? Say and know how handsome, beautiful, brilliant, sweet, kind, peaceful you are inside and out. Okay? Tell yourself. I'm on doing the... Hold on, y'all. Yeah. All right, y'all. Yeah. Tell yourself you love you. Say it often so that you don't have to wait on no one else to say it to you. And believe it. Okay. I can't support my kids and me. I fit into this world, finishing my path and destiny. Then they say that at first. Yeah. Yes, you do. I can see my future, so I work on it. Okay. Okay. Let's see what my little. is uh, Spanish and the cube. Okay. Whatever that means for y'all. Grab bag. neighbor's son having sex with his sister. Wow, that kind of go back to the story, huh? Wow, 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 wow. Tricking his aunt. And we have duck. Whatever that means for you. Okay. Be chakra wisdom. I'm going to let y'all go. Hope it gives you some kind of uh, insight or some kind of something to help out in some type of way. Heads up or whatever it may be. Maybe the breakup ain't happened yet. Maybe it's time to stop at a hill of time before it do happen. And be open and honest. I gave you two cards. Sixth chakra, third eye chakra, inner knowing. I trust my inner knowing and I am at peace with myself. I create more moments of stillness and silence and I listen for the truth. I am open to con connecting with and listening to my gut and my heart's feelings. And I don't override them with my mind's logic. I practice meditation, prayer, and contemplation. Okay. And the other one is third chakra, solar plexus, self-discipline. My self-discipline and willpower will significantly help me in my efforts to move forwards and grow. I am free of the need for approval of others. I face each challenge with determination and courage. And I am determined to live my life to its full potential. I am strong and capable. 
My actions speak louder than my words. All right, Jimmy Jam, Sun and Taurus rising. Hope this helps in some type of way, okay? This is your girl, Ruth, signing off. Like, subscribe, share, and comment. I really appreciate it. And I'll talk to y'all later. All right, love y'all. Bye.